worry, not a tent. If you want to go camping, Dad will take you. Won't you, dear? Oh, uh, yes. Uh, oh. Yahoo! Nasha, we're going camping! Yes, yes. Fit. I used to be top scout in the Beano Town Wolf Pack, you know. Yay! Camping is going to be so cool! So, what did you do in the Beano Town Wolf Pack, Dad? It was brilliant, Dennis. Living outdoors, finding our own food, recognizing all the different plants and animals. <gasps> really? What's this called? Oh, well, that's a. Uh, uh, that, that, that's a rare specimen, actually. Uh, let, let me What's think. that tree called? Yeah. And that bird? What well, kind of grass is this? What's that, Dad? Stinging nettles. Funny, that's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> Oi, look what you've done to my bivouac. Your bivouac? A bivouac is a shelter made from branches, leaves and moss. Oh, I thought it was just a funny-looking tent. Tents are for softies. I made that myself. Name's Tough. Terry Tough. Well, it couldn't have been much good if it broke so easily. Bet my dad could build a better one. Oh, you think so? Yeah, he knows all about that outdoorsy stuff. He was top scout in the Beano Town Wolf Pack. Was he now? I suppose you're an expert at bivy building then. Absolutely. Possibly. Uh, I might have missed that meeting. But, Dad, I, I thought you said... But, yes, I do know a thing or two about the great outdoors. Go on, Dad, you tell him. Really? So, you wouldn't mind proving that then? <laughs> Not at all. This your tent? Yes, but I... Now put it back up. I'll build a new bivouac. See who's quickest. <laughs> Looks like one nil to tough, Nasha. <laughs> now, let's see how good you are at fire lighting, eh? Oh. <laughs> it's hard work, this. Of course, you know how to make herbal tea. I think Dad might have been exaggerating the whole Top Scout thing. <coughs> Not at all. In fact, I'm just getting warmed up. What's next? Way to go, Dad. You tell him. What's next? Oh, I think I've got just the thing. Bring it on. That's Mount Beano. First one to the top and back is the best outdoorsman. Agreed? Agreed! And one other thing. The loser leaves the campsite and never comes back. Well, if that's how you want it, fine. Are you sure you need all this stuff, Dad? <sighs> A Beano Town wolf cub should be prepared for anything. <laughs> See you later. Don't get lost. Wow, he's fast. Dad, we'd better get moving if we want to keep up. Dad? Just checking the direction, Dennis. Now, was it the wet finger into the wind means north? Or... Let's just head for Mount Beano. Or was it see which way the grass blows and divide by the angle of the sun? I can't remember. 
Oh, well, uh, let, let me think. That? Ah! Oh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, 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 oh back off, Billy. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. Gives me an idea, though. I don't believe it. They're gaining on me. But if something was to slow them down, by accident, of course. Oh, I'm suddenly very tired. Must be the mountain air. Goodness, was that me? Oops. <laughs> it didn't look so high from down there. Come on, Dad. We're almost at the top. Just don't look down. You're right, Dennis. Don't look down. Mustn't look down. Dad! <laughs> Hussy! Hussy! There! 
Yes, Bee, it's a horsey. <laughs> Why don't you go and play in the garden with your hobby horse? Dennis will help you. Dennis! Yeah. Horsley? And here's Dennis. One shot away from glory. What do you think of that, Bee? <laughs> and don't bring her back until you've made it up to her and she's calmed down. <laughs> Gran, what's all that crying about then? I could hear you a mile away. I broke Bee's hobby horse and I'm trying to find her a new one. Oh, well, that's all right, then, isn't it? Oh, what's all that fuss about, eh? Poor little Bee. <laughs> oh, she is in a mood. <laughs> that's because nobody's got any. Hobby horses. We've been walking round the shops for hours. And Dad says I can't bring her back until she's calmed down. Dear me, you are in a pickle. What are you going to do? I don't know. Ah! Huh? Hang on. I've been thinking. Uh, riding hobby horses is really for little babies. Baby? Yes. And you're a big girl, aren't you? How would you like to ride on a real horse instead? Real horses? Gran, can you look after B? I've got a plan. We're horsey. Any minute now, love. Dennis is just bringing him. Why do we have to do this? Cos we're mates, Curly. And mates help each other out, right? <laughs> now, remember, you've got to convince her you're a real horse. So no talking or mucking about, OK? OK. <gasps> horsey! Horsey! That's right! Told you I'd get you one. Uh, nay! <laughs> B! No! Horsey, eat! Joy! <laughs> and what you doing letting that child pull up all this grass, eh? And who said you could bring that animal in here? Come on, Parky! Anyone can see it's not a real one. Real horsey! All of you! Out of the park! <coughs> oh, this is a stupid idea, Dennis. What's in it for us, anyway? Come on, Curly. We're making Bee happy. What could be better than that? How about a pie? OK, let's just give her a ride and you can have any pie you want. OK? Now wait here while I go and get her. Oh, oh yum. Pie face, where are we going? OK. Angle of inclination, seven degrees. Wind speed, about three knots south southwesterly. Very good, Father. Stand aside, please. Uh, ah. Oh, Father, you must take more care. We're horsey. <laughs> Father! Oh. 
horse with him, has he? OK, I'll, uh, I'll keep a sharp lookout. Oi! <laughs> right! before we get into any more trouble. Well, see. <laughs> Hang on a minute, love. I'll just go and see. <laughs> oh, never mind, Dennis. You did your best. But what am I going to do about B? I still can't take her home. <gasps> B! Horses and riders allowed through this entrance. But my little sister's in there. You've got to let me through. You think I'm stupid or something? Now either show me your horse or I'm going to have a word with that policeman. OK, Gran. Let's get the horse. So, here they are, under starter's orders for the final race of the day, the Beano Town Classic. And they're off with the favourite moving straight to the front, ridden by... Oh, 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 there seemed to be a change of rider... Heavens! I know jockeys are small, but that one's absolutely tiny! Ooh, can't be much bigger than B! <laughs> Wait a minute! That is B! And that's Dennis! Hang on, B! We're coming! Wheelie Grand! Now, there's something very strange going on here because I don't recognise that horse at all. And now there's a police car. What an extraordinary race this is! Faster Grand! And now there's a dog on the track. Yes, <laughs> And as they approach the final fence, they're neck and neck. It's anybody's race. Come here, B! <laughs> Faster, Grand! Side. At least B was happy, even if we did have to sell the car to pay for the damage. I don't know. I don't miss it that much. And think of the money we're saving by not having one. You all right in there, Dennis? Yes. And you, Gran? Yes. Jolly good. Off we go, then. Giddy up! Yay! <laughs> Never forget, in the wrong hands, there is nothing more dangerous than a canoe. Except, perhaps, a brain-eating squid. <laughs> I'll now show you how to make a canoe motor out of a pelican. Mm. This is boring. Yeah, I've had enough lectures. 
time to liven things up. You guys coming? Oh, taking the canoe without asking. Fine. Spend the rest of the day listening to the Colonel. Stop! You are not authorised to pilot that vessel. Yes, you heard how dangerous canoes are. Not to mention brain-eating squids. I reckon one of them got your brain, Walter. See ya! Uh, Mrs. Creature! Colonel! Yes, many a man has been led astray. They're too far away. They can't hear us. Dennis isn't getting away with this. Follow me! Life on the rolling waves. Nothing like it. What is it, Nasha? <gasps> I don't believe it! <laughs> Looks like they want to race! <laughs> Faster! Stroke! 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 <sighs> oh, oh. Uh, hi, Walter. What's up? Pull that canoe over! I'm making a neighbourhood watch arrest! The neighbourhood's back on land, twit face. Oh, uh, we may have a problem here. Go back! Stupid! Why do you have to do that? I don't think it's been old town. Dennis! Dennis! <gasps> Curly! Oh no, mate! You've been cut in half! No! I'm under here! Pull me out! <laughs> <laughs> to go with a deserted island. Cool. Uh, it's not totally deserted. Quiet! Follow me! Get us down from here! Wow! We heard something, probably you lot, and decided to hide. Sure thing, Walter. Go on, boy. You know what to do. <laughs> I hope you're happy. We're marooned, and it's your fault. You should be thanking me. Thanking you? Dennis Land is the best thing that ever happened to us. What's Dennis Land? The name I just gave me island. Think, no parents, no school, no homework. This is Dennis Land. So whatever I say is law, and whatever you say must be ignored. Huh. We'll see about that. Bertie, Dudley, how would you like to be part of my new island named Walter World. Say yes. Um, um yes. yes. <laughs> Good luck, suckers. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see who the sucker is. I pinched this from Curly when he wasn't looking. Ha! <laughs> Survival of the fittest. Excellent. Let's eat it now. <laughs> no. We need to ration it. Mmm. <laughs> Children are missing. Oh, we have to call the authorities. There's no time. 
Squid could be eating their brains as we speak. <laughs> what are you doing? I don't know how to drive a canoe. Neither do I. But who needs experience when you have rank? Now row, woman, row! Oh. Time to have some fun! their life, not a care in the world. You said it. So, when's dinner? I'm starved. OK, there's one care in the world. You mean no dinner? No pies? We're starved! How long have we been in this place? It's only been an hour, pie face. So long! Wait, Curly, what about that chocolate bar you had this morning? Oh, yeah. Um, Oh, yeah, it's here somewhere. Uh, it, oh, it's gone! Somebody stole it! Oh, Walter! He's stolen from the tribe! This means war! <laughs> yes! Almost there! Finished! Ha! Oh, excellent! We'll soon be out of here! So, uh, when can we have our clothes back? When we're rescued, which could be days, months, years. <laughs> hey, wait a second. Is that chocolate on your mouth? Uh, no. <gasps> He's eaten practically all of it. <laughs> Stay back. Remember, this is Walter World, which means you can't hurt Walter. There they are. Look, there's the chocolate bar in Walter's hand. He's threatening the chocolate bar. Must save chocolate bar. <laughs> Hi, face. Wait. Guess the war started. Stop. One more sip and I eat it all. <gasps> What's that? Don't worry. I'll save your chocolate bar. <laughs> under control. I declare this land Colonel Country.
joke shop. Yes, stay away from it. Do something sensible for a change. All right. I'll take Nasha for a nice walk. <laughs> to the joke shop! <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Mr. Ha Ha! Dennis, good to see you again. You too. So, what's new? Ah, vampire chattery teeth. <laughs> With a difference. <laughs> Added bad breath. <laughs> cool. <laughs> oh, hello, Mother. Oh, yes, Mother. No, Mother. Oh, of course, Mother. What's wrong? My mother, she's flying into Beano Town this morning, which means she's going to find out I run a joke shop. So, what's the problem? When she gave me money to set up a business, she thought I was a... vet. If she finds out the truth, I'll have to close down. <gasps> close the shop? No! I'm afraid so. Unless... <gasps> we turn this shop into a vet for the day! You mean... Play a trick on my mother? <laughs> well, well, I mean, that would be... Fun? <laughs> Curly, get Pie Face and get down to Mr Ha Ha's. We've got an emergency. Mother, quick, hide! Mother! Hello, Hardy. Uh, welcome to my practice. Uh, how, how was your journey? The flight was bumpy, the taxi was smelly. This is it? Yes? You don't seem very busy. Uh, I'm expecting my assistant to bring in a patient any second. That's us! Come on, Nasha! Ah, there you are. And who is this little fellow? Uh, uh, Nasha. And what seems to be the problem? Uh, uh, pointy arrowitis. Ah, yes. Pop him on the table. Surely there's no hope. Shouldn't you just put him out of his misery? <laughs> Let's see. Uh, mallet, a clamp. <laughs> Mr. Ha Ha, I think we need an anaesthetic. Let us begin. Uh, Mother, you'd better sit down. Uh, tweezers. Check. Lights. Check. Dramatic music. Check. Then I'm going in. Ooh. Oh, yeah. uh, oh, no, just, oh, just throw things there. That's one. Oh, yeah, and then there. Oh, oh. oh, last one. It's going to be tricky. <gasps> Don't lose it now, Doctor. Now to wrap up. There, right as rain. <laughs> further treatment, won't he? D oh, yes. Yes, say in a, a week or two. Well done, Hardy. You've saved him. <sighs> Psst. We've got a problem, Den. Look outside. <laughs> 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 
Uh, oops. Uh, uh, we're closed. Closed? Oh, do your job, Hardy. Save these poor animals now. Oh, yes, Mother. Um. Telescope. Telescope. Uh, telescope. Hmm. Uh, he's cross-eyed. Hey. Uh, he's suffering from uh, the concentric pupils. We've got just the thing. I think he might have, uh, um... Uh, low... Low... volume? Low volume... maximosis! Exactly! Uh, he's lost his voice. Try this, Mr. Ha Ha! Molly <laughs> Wanna Cracker! Next! Mm. Thermometer! Oh, of course. A uh, thermometer. Classic case of nippy rodent syndrome, wouldn't you say, Mr. Ha Ha? Oh, definitely. Yes, a, a very bad chill. No problem. This will warm him up. I'm very proud of you, Hardy. Now, give me a tour of Beano Town so I can show off my clever son. Oh, yes, Mother. Dennis, help! Dr. Ha Ha, what about our vet school? Vet in training, uh, that's us. Oh, yes, eager to learn. More school? <gasps> Hardy, you've got little apprentices. You're so dedicated. Go. Teach. <clears throat> Oops. And who is this? I'm the local vet, and I've been getting a lot of dissatisfied customers. Uh, ah. May I suggest, Mr. Ha Ha, that you stick to what you know. Go back to running a joke shop. I can't believe my ears. A joke shop? Can this really be true, Hardy? You run a joke shop? But it's the best shop in town, Mrs. Ha Ha. My favourite. Please don't be angry. Fooling you was my idea. Angry? I'm shocked. Hardy Ha Ha, you always said you wanted to be a vet. Mother, that was when I was five. But can you honestly say that you're happy? Larking about in a joke shop? We're all happy in the shop, Mrs. Ha Ha, aren't we? Oh, oh yes. yes! I suppose if you're happy, that's all that really matters. Well, don't just stand there gawping. Show me everything! <laughs> Results! Oh, well, if you'd like to come this way, Mother, here we have a drawer full of fake doggy doodles. <laughs> That's always a winner. Uh, of course, the bigotry. Wigs, hats, itching powder, whoopee cushions. <laughs> 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 Popularity rock in a bag. Oh, it's a winner. <laughs> oh, dear. God, it's hilarious. Dennis, I thought I told you to stay away from this joke shop. But, Mum... Oh, please don't be too hard on him. Boys will be boys and they all like a joke. And some of these things are quite amusing. <laughs> Very amusing, in fact. <laughs> I think you got off quite lightly, considering. Let me see now. While setting the world speed record for three boys and a dog on one skateboard, you managed to terrify Walter and mess up his sweater. 
flatten Pokeballs' as prize roses and turn yourselves into human pin cushions. Sorry, Mum. Well, I've calmed Parky and Walter down and I've offered to wash Walter's sweater, but be more careful in future, OK? Now run along, all of you. Thanks, Mum. And there's some chocolate chip cookies in the kitchen. So cool, Dennis. She's always standing up for you. Yeah, I bet you've got her something really great for Mother's Day, haven't you? Eh? Mother's Day? I made my mum a vase. Well, more of a pie dish, really. Curly, when is Mother's Day? Tomorrow, of course. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> Super Emergency Fund! How am I going to get Mum a Mother's Day gift? I know! She likes music! I'll write her a Mother's Day song! Let me see. Uh, yeah, Mum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Mum, you're so cool. Oh, yeah. Uh, you really rule. Any ideas? Uh, na, na, na. Brilliant! Yeah, Mum! You're so cool. Oh, yeah, you really rule. For goodness sake, Dennis, you'll wake B up. Stop that horrible racket at once. So she doesn't like music after all. Back to the drawing board. <gasps> the drawing board? Yeah. Curly, weren't you top of the class in Mrs Creature's last art test? Well, yes, but... Uh... a crick in me neck. Won't be much longer, then. You can't hurry art, you know. <laughs> What's that? Get out! Oh. <laughs> I quite like it. That's because it doesn't look like me. It looks like a pie. It's not my fault. Even Leonardo da Vinci couldn't pay it properly if he was being attacked by fleas. I can't give it to me, Mum. We'll have to think of something else. Everything we need for cheesecake or a pie face. Your mum will love it. OK, let's get going. Yeah. <sighs> Really good pie face. What now? We have to leave it to set. Put it on the shelves. Dennis! <laughs> ah, there you are. It's supper time, OK? Hmm, <laughs> pity. It would have been the best yet. about borrowing some flowers from the Colonel's garden. Forgot a gift for Mother's Day? Yeah. That's bad. Your dad always gets me something nice. So, when Dad was a boy, what would you have liked him to get you? <laughs> well, he was a bit of a menace too, you know. I'd have been happy if he'd just kept out of trouble. Of course! That's it! Gran, you're a genius! The trick. This'll be a Mother's Day Mum will never forget. Good dad. Good mum. There you go, Mum. Happy Mother's Day. Oh! What's this, then? <laughs> oh! Wow! A Wii Games console! <laughs> and the latest game for it! Superbike GP Battle of the Champions! Oh! Thanks, son! See what he got me? Oh, he's such a good boy. Yes, he is. Happy 
happy Mother's Day, Mum. Tennis, how lovely. I didn't think you'd remember. Of course I did, Mum. And for your present, I'm going to stay out of trouble for a whole day. Well, that would be nice. Dennis, stay out of trouble? I'll believe it when I see it. Well, just stay in my room, OK? I can't get into any trouble there. you what, Nasha. We'll just practice a few skateboard tricks. about Dennis. <laughs> good, good. Tell you what, best of three. You're on. of getting into trouble there. <laughs> this is cool, Nasha. A total trouble-free zone. <laughs> oh, no! The window! <laughs> oh, only just... Hey, Dennis! We're going fishing in the park. Want to come? Yeah! Great idea! A nice quiet afternoon's fishing in the park, Nasha. I mean, it's not like skateboarding, is it? What could possibly go wrong? <sighs> Everything all right, dear? Still feeling relaxed? Mm, yes. Oh, almost too relaxed. Here go! Hey, my hat! Hey, what the? Must be caught on a root or something. So then he said, "Pardon me, Al. Is that the cat that chewed your new shoes?" <laughs> 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 Mum, how about you, dear? Have you enjoyed your day? Oh, yes. It's been so peaceful and quiet. Well, the day's nearly over, so you'd better brace yourself. Ah, Dennis. I'm guessing this is the end of Mother's Day, then? Yeah. Uh, sorry, Mum. Normal service has been resumed. Dennis. Yes. Now, let's all just calm down. <laughs> Bee's nappy cream, Dad's greasy hair oil, and Mum's silky face cream. 
Time to test out my latest Go Fast Oil Masher. Dennis? Uh-oh. Time for some amateur dramatics, Nasha. <laughs> Wait until I tell your father. Mmm. Pizza would be great, Mum. What? what? What's Dennis been up to now, Sergeant Slipper? Well, he, he, uh, he, uh, he ran over my Woof. foot and... Uh... Nasha, you know Dad doesn't like you eating out of his hat. What are you talking about, Dennis? Hmm. You know, he might have had a bit of a bump on the head. You think? Uh, maybe you should, uh, well, you should take him to the hospital for a once-over. Yes. Well, I suppose I'd better. Looks like we buffed our way out of trouble again, Nasha. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. No, not you, Nasha. Pets aren't allowed in hospital. Nasha! So, what do you think's wrong with Dennis, Doctor? Hmm, his um, odd behaviour could be due to his fall. It had better be. Hmm. Oh, this place is no fun. I wish Nasha was here. <laughs> I could have sworn that... Let's get Dennis to the X-ray department. A quick scan should confirm what's going on up here. Hey, watch it! I'm not well, Mum. So, how is Dennis, Doctor? Hmm. Extraordinary. It appears your son has swallowed a dog. Nasha! <coughs> Come away, Nasha. The doctor says Dennis needs total rest. No, I just need to go home. Well, out of the question, I'm afraid. We need to keep Dennis overnight for observation. Overnight? But, but... That's fine, Doctor. Dad! You heard what the doctor said, Dennis. Come on, Nasha. Time to get you home. <laughs> now, the rules of my ward are no pets, no chocolate, no TV, no computer games and no... Fun! This place is worse than school. No complaining. You're here to get better, not to have fun. Hi, Dennis. What? Walter? Do you know Walter? Yeah. Unfortunately. Well, he's quite the star in our hospital radio. Yes, I'm their best volunteer DJ. Tune in to Walter's Radio Marathon tonight. It's going to be jazz-tastic. Ciao. Oh, why didn't I just fess up and take the punishment? It couldn't have been worse than being stuck in here with DJ Walter. Now, Dennis, if you need anything, just buzz this buzzer and I'll come running. You will? Cool. Yes? Could I have some water, please? Certainly. Could you pass me a comic? What about your water? Could you... Anything else you'd like me to do before I buzz off? No, thank you. I hate this hospital! <laughs> oh, hang on. Meatballs, my favourite. Here you are, Walter. 
That should keep you topped up for your radio show tonight. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Shame there's only steamed cabbage left. <laughs> Catch you later, listeners. Nasha, good to see you. <laughs> Quick, hide. <laughs> Can I go home now, Doc? No, I'm afraid you aren't going anywhere for 24 hours. But there's nothing wrong with... That is, I feel much better. Honest. Rest is what you need, and rest is what you will get. No, I need to go home. Mum and Dad will be missing me. Oh, it's so peaceful without Dennis under our feet. I've told your mother and father that you'll be under observation until we see a real improvement. Improvement? Him? <laughs> Sounds like you'll be in here a while, Dennis. <laughs> That's it! We're breaking out of here now! One. But I'll never fit into that. You don't need to. It's a bed bath. A what? But, but, I had a bath last month. Wait! I... Whoa! Oh, that's... Freezing! No dogs allowed. Yes, though he is still very tired, he'll need much more rest. Oh, you could say that again. Oh. 